Hello everybody and welcome back to opening the treasure chest with me, Get Dave. A lot of, a lot of jingles to start the episodes lately. An illuminated sea chart is our reward. Oh, that ain't something I wanted you to see. And you've gone and got the bounty to boot. Well, you could wear more pants if you don't want us to see it. Hang on. Is that all it is? That scraggy old bit of paper? That's pathetic. If I'd have known it was as naff as that, I'd never have bothered. I suppose I'll just have to make do with the 10,000 gold coins I picked up on the way. <laughs> Pocket change. Right, I'm out of here. I've had enough of this damn old to last me a lifetime. Uh, okay. She got all that dough down here. She's a sly old fox, that red. Sorry, I was just biting my tongue on another comment I could have made. Well, we go what we come for. Ain't no point in us hanging around here no more, neither. Alright, yeah. Uh, we done. As long as... Jackpot. Alright, now, confession time. <laughs> My headphones are dying. I have nothing in the left ear. The right ear is finicky, but I have draped the wire in a very special way. Oh, you know what? Let's check out our illuminated sea chart. So, you wouldn't even notice that unless... Yeah, X marks the spot. To Neos, I guess? Anyway, I might cut off people while they're speaking. I might hit the button too soon. We'll see. Otherwise, I don't really need the audio for the game. I can make the sound effects in my heart. I'd have new ones, but I'm... And it's not like I have fancy headphones or anything. Headphone talk! <laughs> With Audiophile Dave! Um... Talking headphones? Uh, we've got lots of options. This one here is the uh, Sennheiser. Something of a Sennheiser fanatic, as you can tell from the tone of my voice. And uh, now I'm going to use the thin air attack for the first time. Anyway, yeah, fun s headphone fact. I'm a little picky about getting Sennheisers. The value! Yeah, they're the, uh, the underdog. And the great... The great struggle against Beats by Dre and Bose. All right, any any headphone opinions are welcome in the chat or uh, comment section. Pardon me. Let me know if I'm wrong. But I'm not made of money, so that's no to bows. All right, I think I'm gonna turn right. Oh, that's right there. I wonder if we can get Octorion on that beach. Also, that Captain Crow was in, unable to figure out the puzzle of the map with the X on it and a path pointing directly to a spot. I mean, it's not like it's only the hero can see it or something, because Yangus is looking. Oh, so we went to the X! And it showed the thing on the map. He didn't deserve those 10,000 coins, red pinched. I 
How much can you go off the path? I don't know. I'm, a I'm afraid to find out. Oh, but you know what? All right, now we know. <laughs> There you go. Science is successful. Uh, this one didn't involve me dying, which is always a nice science. Oh, do we get the cutscene again? And I was bad-mouthing Captain Crow. Oh, there's no skip cutscene button. Oh, there's only the dislike button. The unsubscribe. The death threat. It's our only recourse. I mean, in real life, the death threat is much more common than the dislike button. I've been on the internet. It's quite a place. Wonder how... I'll explain it to my grandchildren someday. Well, kids, the internet used to be... Used to be a nice place in the suburbs. But now it's turned into Mad Max, which we'll watch after. It's education. Yeah, you can get in fights here. Wow, it was really close. I blew it at the last second. Just like that Star Trek episode. Are we gonna find... a less advanced civilization? But with a cunning intellect? Welcome to the isolated plateau. Well, let's check it out. I know what you're wondering. Dave, is there a lot of stuff? And the answer is yes. There's a lot of stuff. But first, gotta done get up there. Oh, a alligator. Uh, okay, first off, we'll get... I mean, we gotta get Yangus so we can cast Kabuff, right? I mean, where would we be without that? Beyond that, there's this kind of strong enemy that looks just like this one later on. Yeah, he's pretty tough. Dang. We did around 400 damage. Boom. Yeah, I think we did just under. So he's maybe 400 to 450 hit points. At this point in the game, there's a chance we could have 
the end game spear. But hello. But you can still get quality milk here. Kind of a empathetic game design that there was a cow right there. Yeah, I'll bite. Oh, okay. We can handle a group of five. They're not so tough. I think it has to be the thin air attack. I mean, without Kaboom. And I mean, how do you argue with that damage? Nice little death touch. Even down two, they're horrifying. All right. I love me that armor. Yeah, they won't last long now. Double thin air attacks. You're gonna be down to like 40% HP. And then... Ooh. And yeah, there's a lot of treasures up here. Huh. Got a cute little bird. All right, map, what can you tell them, okay? No one's like ever been here, but we know there's a village. It's my kind of map. I guess we should check it out. I wonder if a saber cat can get to us. Uh oh. So a different version of this enemy has oomph. So I think we, we got to prioritize them. They've got some hit points. They've got a lot of hit points. Okay, they can kind of do it all. There we go. Well, that's nice. That's a nice little silver lining. I could try a crackle. Kind of surprised we got one. Also, how about that turn order? Ah, uh, you know what? Let's try. Let's try the crackle. I'm curious. Eh.
Oh, right, I went the opposite direction. Hmm. Well, I guess there's nothing to do but look in the dead center of this poison swamp for a treasure! Well, let's do this in style. Oh, it happened! Oh. It didn't happen. We're too remote. Too, too remote. But! Oh, hello. Can I call you Mr. Big? Maybe I should have healed first. Okay. Alright. It's fine. Make the viewership do it. Ha <laughs> ha! Oh, no capers. I feel bad about it, but we just can't spare the time to zoom to a person that could immediately make the problem go away for free. All right, you've got some moves. By my math, we're looking at about 750 damage. I didn't stand in after I beat... Wow. I'm being really irresponsible. Okay. All right. There we go. See, he's not so tough. He just had 900 hit points. Silver? Oh? Yeah. Yeah, I, I think he had a good audition. Just out of curiosity. He doesn't stack up terribly. Yeah, probably he averages out uh, to bring. Yeah, you know what? But he just he just attacks. He doesn't do any of the other nonsense. Well, Torchman, you are always a long shot, Brontes. And... Oh man, this pains me. Uh, listen, big friendly jargon. Let, let's talk. We just want to bring in some... Uh, some youthful energy onto the team. Uh, try having one less eye in the lineup, see if that gets us any more wins. Oh, hello. That. Oh, okay. All right, let's, let's. Do we have a magical hat? Oh, shoot. I might not. I might have to go buy one. <laughs> well, darn it. Okay, well, we're gonna be, uh, we're gonna be in a great place once we get one. Uh, I guess in the meantime... See, so the nice thing... Yeah, okay. It's got an attack power. No one can deny that. You don't really do a ton of attacking with a staff, though. I know. I give great, great tips. 
Alright, I guess we go south along the coast-ish. Hello, cow. If I'd actually gone to impeach you, I would have been able to zoom and we'd have the alchemy pot brewing something helpful right now. Instead of wasting all these steps. Oh, a little bit of a ridge. Oh, hello. Are you on this side? Yes, you are. Oh, no. Oh, okay. Elysium birds we've dealt with. Yeah, we'll do this first. This isn't a, a fight where I would totally use Kaboom. All right. That was more or less wasted. <laughs> Okay, good. That's the opening we need. Last one's pretty tough. I appreciate his uh, targeting. Okay, I should probably heal her. But what if I cheated for offense instead? Fine. But I don't think we ever found out how many hit points they do have because I did this and got the lethal hit. That's how many. Ooh, that was Metal Slime experience. So close. I don't really know why I'm putting points into humanity. I guess. So we could learn mid-heal at this point in the game. Yeah, some funny attacks though. The first time I played through this game, I like I used underpants dance a lot. A lesser panacea for... okay. Alright, we have a little bit of a walk ahead. We gotta go around the lake, so... Now it's a good time for some holy protection. There's a lot of cows here. Probably sign of a civilization, though. We've got livestock. Guess they could be wild cows, but those don't really look like they're gonna last too long. There's allegedly a monster around the corner somewhere. We can take a peek, I guess. It's the Torayama one, so I'm going to at least look. Which I'm pretty sure is like a Draki. I mean, we already have Hori, so... We've got the Slime Creator, why not go for the whole set? 
Wow, exactly 350. It also has multiple potential locations, so... So we go north. Oh, I can see it from here. 